Welcome to our lesson about the Rectangular Pattern Tool. Let's begin by activating the tool. First, we can select a feature to pattern, or we can use the entire solid. I'm going to select a feature. I'll select this hole. Now we select Direction 1. Let's click this arrow. Number of instances, 3. The Mid Plane option lets you distribute the pattern in both directions. Spacing, let's make it 1.5 inches. From this drop down menu, we can also select distance. Now, basically, the distance between these two holes will be 1.5 inches. Or we can choose curve length, which is this curve I selected. Let's go back to spacing and return the value to 1.5 inches. Now we're ready to select a second direction. Let's select this edge for our second direction. Number of instances, 3. Here we can also select the mid plane option. And we can choose between spacing, distance, and curve length. Let's select spacing and let's click OK. And here's our rectangular pattern. Let's activate the rectangular pattern tool again. This time I'll pattern the entire solid. Select the solid for direction 1, and let's select this edge. Number of instances, 3. Let's use the mid plane option. Spacing, let's say 5 inches. And for direction 2, I'll select this edge. Number of instances, 2. And spacing, let's say 3 inches and click OK. And here is our rectangular pattern. Let's just zoom to fit. This concludes our lesson about the rectangular pattern command.